This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Fundamentals Express course. I'm on Lesson 8, Loops with Foray and BB-8, Puzzle 13. Uh, multiple choice question. As a teacher, let me tell you, when you make a choice and hit run, your answer is submitted. I get my students' answers when they make their decision and hit run. So if you're my student, just to let you know, your decision is locked. You won't be able to edit it once you hit run. So let's choose wisely. All right. A, BBA, oh no, let's see what the code does first. So look closely at the code below. What will happen when you click run? Ooh, lots of these repeat blocks. Now, whatever number is here, that's how many times the stuff in the repeat block runs. Once it runs that many times, so this block, it would run, it would go forward. BB-8 is going to go forward. We'll hit the bottom of the pink, zoop, back up and around, and BB-8 will move forward again. Well, that's now two times. So the computer continues to the next line. And we're going to turn left. So we moved forward once and twice, and then we turn left. Interesting. So we're here now. Um, and then we're going to drop into another repeat. So now we're going to run whatever code this is three times. Ah, forward once, twice, three times. And now we're done with it. So it would drop below and turn right. So we were here, but facing left. So because we turned left, so we moved one two, three times forward, and then we faced right. Okay, so now we're faced right, and then three times forward, one, two, three, and then we're going to face left, and then three times forward, so one, two, three. Oh, tricky. So let's just double check here. Two times forward, one, two, then turn left three times forward. Well, if we're only going two times forward here, it looks like we're going to miss a lot of them. We'll get this one and these two, but not all. Yep. So, right? What, what, what should have happened? Well, we needed to go up three if we wanted to get all. Going up only two means we didn't go far enough in this loop. We turned early. So, I'm pretty sure. Let's give it a shot. Woohoo! Loops are useful and they can be tricky, so it's good to debug. Let's keep going. 